welcome back to Maros Films. In the latest update, the Mavic Pro got the new Peno mode that was only available to the Spark. So I made a tutorial to cover the essentials to get the panorama shots done. Let's make it fast and easy. You press the camera setting icon in photo mode and select photo type. In the end, there is the new Peno mode. You can choose by four different Peno modes. The vertical Peno mode that will take three images that you can later on stitch. The horizontal pano mode that will take 21 horizontal photos. The wide panorama mode that will take up 9 photos. And the 360 sphere mode that will take up 34 pictures to make a mini globe looking picture. You will have to wait some 20 seconds leaving the Mavic to get the job done. You press the play button and select which pen mode you want to be processed. Press into the photo, you process the photo and wait a while and then you get your panorama. There is a problem with the latest app update. It won't let me do the 360 globe processed, that I was the most impressed. I have an X mark like it wasn't successful. And I got a glitch video transmission all the time. So I would recommend to wait a couple of days until DJI fixes this problem before updating to the latest version. I was able to get the 360 flat panorama via the desktop DJI Media Maker by importing the single photos that the Mavic Pro created in a folder and selecting the 360 panorama mode. It takes some minutes to complete. After that, importing the picture in the application called Tiny Planet Maker and saving it to my phone. Please DJI fix this problem because I really want to use this feature in the full glory. This was a short end of the week tip. If you found this video useful, give me a thumbs up and also subscribe if you wanna see more tips like this. Until the next time, have a really great weekend. Goodbye.